So this is how you are going to set up photo albums in the devices touch chat program. So you're going to go first to groups, then we're going to go down to photos down here at the bottom, and you're going to see you have a few sample photos of photo albums at the top, and then a bunch of other pages that are already set up for you where you can just add your own images. So to see what it's going to look like, if we went to this fun pics one, um, you can see that there's a photo on the left side, and then on the right, it's got a little bit of a description or a part of the story. Having fun on the carousel. Okay. So what you do with this is you would maybe take pictures of an activity that you did or something fun that you were doing in your classroom, take several pictures, and then the student can help you write the text that goes with that image. So think about it kind of like a little storybook, a little narrative that they're able to write. So then if we go back to this um, photo album, the way you're gonna set it up for something new is like this. You're going to go on this page, you're gonna select menu and edit page. Then we're gonna go to a button. Okay, I'm gonna choose edit this button. Um, maybe I'm gonna name it um, AMS visit and put some pictures from my visit to the school. Uh, I'll pick a picture for just this cover image. So I'm going to say, let's import or select an image. Oh, I'm sorry. We're going to say, let's, uh, let's uh, import a photo. We're going to go out to our photo pages and I'm going to just, let's see. I'm just going to select a photo. We'll just pick any one. I'll pick this one. Okay. And I'll say use and then I'm going to name it AMS Visit. All right, that will save it in my, in my library, AMS. Okay, let's say done. And save. Okay, so there it is right there. Now when I want to go in and add the, all the other pictures for my visit and text, I'm going to select that button that I just created. Oh, let's see here. I can say done. Okay, done to get out of edit mode select the button that I just created and you can see I've got a blank template right here. So now I'm going to go back to menu, select edit page. I'm going to choose the button where I want to put my next photo. I'm going to say edit the button and I'm going to go down to import photo from my camera roll and I'll pick a picture, use that picture and um, I can name it, let's see, uh, chart. I'll say done. And then I'll make my label. I'm not going to put actually any label on here at all or a message because I'm going to do all of that through the text on the page beside it. So I'm going to say save. And then over on this, this next, beside that, I'm going to select the blank button. I'm going to edit that button. And this is where I'm going to put my text in. So I'm going to type... Um, Mr. Cole's classroom has a chart for getting our devices out. Exclamation point. Okay. And I don't need to put any kind of, oh, let's see, I need to correct my spelling on Mr. Let's do that. All right, and then I'm done. I'm not going to put any image on it because the image is beside it. I'm going to say save. And then now I'm all finished with that one. And you can continue to add, but add images down the page. And I can say done. And now when I go back to this page, so if I go back, I go groups. I'm going to select photos. I'm going to select AMS visit and now you can see where we've got this this little photo album started. I can select my text over here. Mr. Cole's classroom has a chart for getting our devices out. And then we can tell our story and that's it.